so to write Dirac uh, equation in covariant form what we have to do is uh, let us look at the Dirac equation basically the Dirac equation was uh, this one i h cross dou psi by dou t equal to minus i h cross c alpha dot grad psi plus this thing ok so let us write that here again m naught c square psi so this is the Dirac equation now what we do is we multiply this equation by a factor beta by m naught uh, beta by h cross beta by h cross c so this equation you multiply by beta by h cross c so what we will get here you will get i times beta h cross gets cancelled so i beta by c times dou psi by dou t okay and uh, let me bring it to the uh, to this side so plus i beta h cross c h cross c gets cancelled so you get i beta alpha dot grad psi minus beta into beta that will give you beta square which is 1 so you will get m naught c 1 c gets cancelled m naught c by h cross times psi equal to 0 so this is the equation we have got now what we can do is we can try to express um, this thing here is basically okay let me say again write it again i beta by c times dou psi by dou t plus i beta times is basically summation k equal to 1 to 3 alpha k into dou psi by dou x k right that's what is the alpha x dou by dou x k dou x plus alpha by dou by dou y plus alpha by dou x minus m naught c by h cross times psi equal to 0 so here we will uh, now introduce the new matrix called gamma defined as basically what we want is we want gamma k to be equal to minus i beta alpha k minus i beta alpha k this thing here so that would give us uh, this is k equal to 1 2 3 and uh, for k equal to 4 that is gamma 4 will define as beta ok so this will sort of act as beta so what we will get is we will get an i gamma 4 by c dou psi by dou t minus summation k equal to 1 to 3 i beta alpha k is minus gamma k so minus gamma k dou psi by dou x k minus m naught c by h cross psi equal to 0 so if you were to now consider x mu as a 4 vector so we have um, x1 x2 x3 and uh, the fourth one x4 is generally written as uh, uh, i times x naught where x naught is basically c into t okay so x4 is uh, basically i times c t so what we have to do is you have to replace this i you bring it down so you will get a minus ic into t that minus ic t will become x naught so you will get minus gamma 4 dou psi by dou x naught here and you have a summation k equal to 1 to 3 gamma k dou psi by dou x k minus this of course m naught c by h cross times psi equal to 0 so you have now through and through minus sign that goes away and then these two we will try to club them together 
by using the mu. So summation mu equal to 1 to 4, you will have gamma mu into dou psi by dou x mu plus m naught c by h cross times psi equal to 0. So this is what we call as the covariant form of Dirac equation. Of course, using the Einstein summation formula, we can always, uh, because there is a mu, so we can always get rid of the summation and generally dou, x, dou, dou by dou x mu is also written as dou mu psi. So this is how you will see in a very shorthand notation the Dirac equation in covariant form. And uh, this is what is the central equation for relativistic quantum mechanics. Thank you.